If you use git as your version control, you always need to set up that git ignore in your repo to exclude files that you don't want to track, for example, cache or IDE files. But for multiple reasons, sometimes I forgot to add it before I start committing my code. Let me show you how to create a global .git ignore and by default exclude files for all your new repositories. Open a terminal and go to your home directory. Run touch .git ignore slash global or whatever name you want. This will create a new empty file. Now let's configure the files we want to exclude. For that, I will use gitignore.io. Here, I will exclude files from Xcode, Swift Package Manager, and macOS. Let's copy and paste the result in the gitignore global file using the editor of your choice. And finally, let's run this command to indicate the excluded files in the global config. Now we are going to clone a new repo that I just created. Here, I have added a new project called Amiibo TCA. Let's add and commit the files. You can see that IDE files are gone and we keep only the files that we care. Now, if we push and review the remote repo, we can see that our project files are there and we have excluded the rest. Great. Now you learned how easy it is to set up a global .git ignore for all your new repos. Remember that this is a convenience configuration for you. If you want to work with multiple people, keep adding .git ignore in your repo anyway. And if you want to learn about Swift, check out more content in the description below. My name is Pete and this, this is Ivan Tips. Thanks for watching and have a great day.